you learned the transformation spell. After you've completed the required tasks, which I'm certain will... my class to learn the new spell. Afterwards, we will... I wonder who lives here. I know what that means. Merlin. Aha! There you are! Protego! Contrigo! Incendio! Time to go a little quicker. Go!
Who lived here, I wonder? It's exhausting. Standing here all day waiting to do Rockwood's work for him. He can fight his own battles. Rebellion! from Horntel Hall. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Surprise. You're the one who stole our garbage. Well, there, but then it was ours. I know. Who goes? What's that? Incendio. Quite stately in its time.
will send it. Assignment's all finished. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Rebellion.
So this is the underground harbor. Rebellio. Rebellion. around here somewhere looking for the book intermediate professor weasley asked me to uh get something from that book may i have it did she now i'll give you this book if you humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz quiz some people call bits of knowledge trivia i would argue that no knowledge is trivial hence i have created a small quiz just for fun focusing mainly on the law of the wizarding world None of the other students will try it, no matter how many times I ask. They all say they have enough with schoolwork. Oh, they don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. A quiz sounds like fun. Splendid! Just a few questions and then I'll hand over this book. 
Let us begin. Before the invention of the Golden Snitch, which magical creature was used in the game of Quidditch? The Golden Snidget. Correct! The Snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard named Barbarous Bragg. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question. Which potion is commonly referred to as liquid luck? Felix Felicis. Well done. Since it makes the drinker temporarily lucky, Felix Felicis is a banned substance in all organized competitions. The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? The Founder's Relics. No, the answer was the Deathly Hallows. According to Beedle the Bard, the Deathly Hall... Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? The Bludger. I'm sorry, but the correct answer was... When... True or false? Polyjuice Potion allows the drinker to change species. False. Correct. While Polyjuice Potion can be used to change things such as age or race, it cannot be used to change species. Well, I suppose this has gone on long enough. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. If you're inclined to test your knowledge again, I have plenty more questions I could ask you. And I won't be giving you any more easy questions either. The next ones will be more difficult. I'd like to answer more questions. What governmental body directly preceded the Ministry of Magic? The Wizards Council. That's correct! The Wizards Council disbanded in... Which dragon breed is the smallest? The Ukrainian Ironbelly. No, I'm sorry, but the... Though the Viper Tooth is the smallest breed, averaging who founded the village of Hogsmeade? Quincy Hogg. No, the answer was Hengist of Woodcroft. It is but the... Alethafold. That's incorrect. The... While the hide behind has... What is the only... The knockback, Jinx. Actually, the answer was the... the... Who published the law? Laverne de Montmorency. That's incorrect. The answer I was looking for was Gamp. One of the principal exceptions to Gamp's law is that food cannot be conjured, though it can be summoned. What does the Hogwarts motto translate to? Knowledge is the real magic. No, the answer was, never tickle a sleeping dragon. In Latin, the Hogwarts motto is, Draco Dormiens Numquam Titillandus. Which magical creature is the only one known to produce eggs through its mouth? The Basilisk. That's incorrect. The correct answer was the Rune's Paw. According to Parcel Mouths, each of the Rune's Paw's three heads... The Pyrenees. No, Ilvermorny is actually... Elixir to induce euphoria. Incorrect. The Amatentia smells... Are you interested? I don't have time for another quiz at the moment. That's fine. Come and find me if you'd like to try later. I put the book back on the pedestal for you. Revelio ought to make quick work of this. Professor Weasley's tasks are complete. I should attend Transfiguration. I heard Professor Weasley transfigured the book with all her test dancers into an owl to stop students from cheating.
Settle down, settle down. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing me say. Now, you all know what to do. Beautifully done. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. And frankly, excelling in your schoolwork this year. Thank you, Professor. The extra assignments have been helpful. As I suspected they would be. Now, it seems you've been making good use of the opportunities presented by your field guide. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. I've heard that you can brew an impressive Edurus potion. Hopefully, you won't need it anytime soon, but it is a valuable potion to have when it is needed. Thank you, Professor. I will say I'm especially impressed with all you've accomplished in light of the rumors of your extracurricular activities. Was your visit to the kitchens and the Hogsmeade graveyard with Nick to bribe a ghost for information connected in any way to Professor Fig? <laughs> 